Greetings from Neuron Themes. In this video, I'm excited to show you how to maneuver inside the template library feature that includes a lot of cool and interesting stuff. Backbone to our theme are demo websites, templates, and blogs that we invest a great deal of time and creativity to make sure you find exactly what you're looking for. You can easily import, configure, design, and combine blogs to build pages using just a few clicks. When introducing the template library, I want to focus on the preset templates and blocks that you have full license on, that you can compile together with all the images presented on the template for your own and customers' websites. This is a page design made of different blocks from the Neuron Library. From the editing screen, if you click on the plus icon of a section, there will appear a box containing two options, one to drag an element and the other to open the template library. To open this tab, you can also use the hotkeys Ctrl or Command, Shift, L, resulting in quickly opening the library. Once you open the library, you will notice it is separated into three different branches, with the first being blocks, which are pre-designed sections that form the base of your website. In this category, you can look for headers, footers, about us sections, clients, and a lot more, using the drop-down menu at the top left corner of the tab. Using the search bar, you can filter pre-designed pages by category, tag, or any other taxonomy. You can preview the template, and if you like it, click on this insert button here. There you have it, all set up and ready to be customized, or if you like it, leave it as it is. Let's import some blocks and design them a little to see the flexibility they present. We will use this block. Now we need to customize and design them to match our style. This is all quite simple and easy. Import any block from Neuron Library. Change the content, design them and publish them. Quite simple, actually. They are highly customizable, as you can edit and adjust them to match your style and overall layout. But sometimes you might like to create your own template from scratch and give it an authentic touch of your style. And that is completely justified and possible. Once you're done crafting your own template, it can be a whole page or a block of its own, you can save it under the My Templates tab of the library. Now, there are two ways to save a template. One being by right-clicking on the section and choosing to save as a template. Let's give it a name. Or if you wish to save a whole page, then click on this arrow next to the Publish button. Let's give it a name as well. And that's about it. Under My Templates, you will have displayed all the templates that you have saved, where you can preview them, check their info, use as many times as you need to, and export the templates, which will then be saved as a JSON file. You can also sync your library items using this icon here, as well as import template files from your computer. Another alternative way of adding a template is by using the template element. Search for it and drag it onto the page. Choose the preferred template from the drop-down menu. And as you can see, it will immediately be imported on your page. Every time you update a template, the changes will adapt to all the pages that you've used the template in. This is due to the sync mechanism included in the template library. Told you it would be cool. As if that wasn't enough, you can access the library through WordPress dashboard, under My Templates, and then here you have categorized all the templates you create but you cannot preview them from this window. The template option here also includes the shortcode of a particular template, in which case you can copy it and paste it whatever you want on the page using the shortcode element. You can use it both ways as you see fit. I would like to end this video here. Tune in for more videos and tutorials by subscribing to our YouTube channel. Thank you for watching.